Hey YouTube, this is Matt the long hair little guy. Um, I'm going to hang out here on this uh, little thing, so bear with me. But today what I want to share with you is uh, three products that I really, really like. Uh, that are kind of time-saving, uh, inexpensive ways that uh, I've just found over the last four seasons or three seasons, three and a half seasons or so that uh, I really like or real benefit. And this first thing that, I'm, that you're looking at, a lot of you guys already know about it, but uh, this is the Echo Speed Feed Head. Okay, now I've got a steel trimmer, all right, but I've got an Echo Speed Feed Head. And when I first started out, I went out to a lawn shop and I was uh, getting some line and the guy said, you want one of these? I says, no, I don't. It's 30 bucks. I don't want one of those. And he's like, yeah, you do. I said, no, I don't. So I left. And later on, uh, I don't know, like my second season or so, what did I do? I went up to Home Depot and I got me a Speed Feed head. So uh, this thing is really, really awesome. Um, I, I'm not very good with the camera work, so I'm just going to kind of hang out right here. But basically the way this goes is you feed, you line up this little nub right here with your holes and you'll be able to see all the way through it. You'll be able to see light. So then you just cut your trim, your trimmer string off and then you just shove it all the way through that hole all the way to the other side and then you turn this cap like that and it winds it up. Man, what a time saver as opposed to uh, rewinding all of your different he heads. And I tried the steel version of it and it sucked. So speed feed all the way. Time saver. You just cut yourself some string, shove in your pocket, you're out there. I mean, you can have this thing rewound in just, I mean, less than a minute, probably. Awesome. It takes about, I put about 15 foot of string on that sucker. So, uh, which leads me to my next thing. What kind of string do I like? I have used all kinds of string. Oh, there it is. Here it is. My truck is wrecked. I've used ugly line, I've used echo string, I've used steel string, I've used all kinds of string. Ugh. Bags of concrete are all over it. But this is what I like. I like the Magnum Gator Line Square 0 0.095. This stuff lasts forever. Okay, I was having trouble with my string breaking. Some guys don't have that. I found out in the people that are like down in Florida. Um, it's real humid down there. And uh, and I think that's why their string lasts a lot longer. But up here in, in uh, uh, Oklahoma, it's really dry. And the string gets really, really brittle. And it'll break off at times. Sometimes it's just because I'm not trimming properly. Uh, but a lot of times it uh it's just really dry out here and this stuff gets brittle and i tried soaking it in some uh, soapy water before uh, this is other string not this string and uh, and that helped out a lot but then i was kind of shopping around i saw this stuff because it's got like this this uh, uh you can't see it very well but you can see on the picture it's some kind of like a metallic core or whatnot and you would think that that would like do a little bit of damage to some stuff but it really doesn't no more than an ordinary string i like the square because it's got edges that cut really really well round does not cut that well and this core really makes the string last forever love this stuff but not everybody carries it uh, around here so i go I, there's a couple people that i know that carry it um, and i get it from them but you can get it online too and it's made by magnum gator line oregon and I found that Oregon products are really, really good. Those are the people that make the Gator Blades uh, that a lot of people like so, so much. And uh, Toro's got their version. They call it a Gator. Uh, well, Toro calls it something else. I can't remember what. Oh, Atomic Blades. But uh, Oregon makes Gator Blades. And here's another product that I absolutely love from Oregon products. This is a Gator Blade, basically, for your edger. I don't use this all the time because I found out that it actually kind of chips up the concrete a little bit. You see how that's feathered out a little bit. But man, on those tough lawns to edge, for that first edge, it will tear it up, man. You will rip right through that stuff, more so than a normal blade. And uh, But I don't use this as my normal edging blade when I edge because um, it, it does have a tendency to kind of chip up the edge of the concrete. So be careful when you use it. But man, this will help you out a lot when you have those cleanups and you got to put a nice edge and you don't want to keep on going over and over and over. Bring out your trimmer more, some, more and more and more. This thing is awesome. Okay, and again, I don't know what it is about Gator uh, or Oregon products, but not everybody carries them, and they are amazing. But these are three products that I really, really like. 
had have saved me a lot of time, a lot of expense. Um, I'm going to flip it around here. And I just really like them. Um, and I don't think there's much more cost. They might be a little bit more expensive. I don't know. But uh, the benefit outweighs any cost. Uh, and so track those down is what I say. Um, this is a popular topic, and that's why I'm covering it. And I decided I would just go ahead and do this. So I'm sharpening my blades today. I'm fixing to go meet uh, uh, another OKC long buddy. That's so I'll see you in a few minutes here, Ben. And... Uh, and then I'm going to get out. i got about eight lawns today. In the afternoon, I'll get started after lunch. So probably, I'm guessing I'll actually put a, a mower on a lawn about one. And I hope to have those eight lawns done by five. So that's going to be a task. But I can do it. I can do it. I think. Maybe I can't. I don't know. But uh, anyways, check out those products. Um, I don't have any links or anything like that. I just want to do a quick video, let you guys know what I like. Uh, yeah, this is a popular topic, especially now with cleanups. And uh, I hope you check them out. I hope you try them out. And let me know what you think. Okay? If you got something better, um, I'd actually be willing to try it out. But i got to say, I'm pretty faithful. This is some pretty good stuff. So anyways, comment, subscribe, like, share, all that stuff. Lord bless and peace out.